Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Wells Knight's Realm. Check out that view. Is that not a beautiful view? We are here in 1.9 pre-release 4, I believe, right? Yes, pre-4. Um, by the time this episode goes up, 1.9 may be officially and completely out, which is awesome. That is a super awesome thing. It has been way too long since Minecraft got a full, big uh, update. So I'm really excited about that, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are as well. But we're here in the desert village, and what I want to do in today's episode, uh, we've been kind of working on like this pathway and a gatehouse and some of that kind of stuff over the last couple episodes, and I want to finish that up. Um, so let's take a look over here. If we follow our little path that leads us through the warehouse, it comes out over here. We get a little diagonal bridge that crosses over, and then we go up and into the gatehouse or the checkpoint or whatever you want to call it. And then I extended this pathway out to over here. So it just kind of follows along this island and comes over to right here. And what I want to do is I want to link up this island with that chunk of land over here. So let's come on over and take a look and just see. I have kind of an idea of what I want to do, um, but it's pretty good size. I mean, it's big. Um... Okay, but it looks like once you are over here, you are connected with the mainland. It looks like this is not its own little island or anything like that. So, that should work. We should be able to connect this thing up, and then it would, you know, connect with this whole area. So, now comes the tricky bit. What I want to do, and this might be a little crazy, but what I want to do is I want to make a rope bridge. A big, long rope bridge and I have kind of an idea of how it's gonna look um, but I've never done one of these before so we're gonna have to kind of test it out and see um, and I think we are almost gonna have to go three wide at least three maybe even four wide for something this big otherwise it's just gonna look weird so let's just do something like that real quick just so we can kind of take a look at it from over here and see how's that going to look. That, yeah, I think that's still too skinny. I think it's going to have to be four wide for this to work, uh, which is fine. That's perfectly fine. Okay, so let's tear this up. Uh, actually, you know what? I think this is the one that I want to kick out a little bit further. Yeah, 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 yeah. So let's actually tear this up all together. Put that sand back. Break that sand right there. And then we'll just build this up a ways. And I don't know yet how high I want that to go. Um... But it's going to have to be relatively high because, first of all, the rope bridge is going to have a natural kind of curve to it. Um, let's see. How's that? Come on. There we go. So it's going to have kind of a natural curve to it, which means we need to allow space for that curve to happen. Um, we also need to figure out just how far this distance is. So, let's see. If we do one, two, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Let me count this out, guys. I'll be back with you in a second. All right, guys, I am back. So, this area marked out in cobblestone, that is 45 blocks. So, that is quite the distance. Um, and I'm thinking what we're basically going to do here is we'll have kind of a platform and it'll kind of rise up. And then we'll bring the rope bridge down 
and across, which will look pretty good, but I need to plan that out. So let me uh, take a little cut here. Let me do some planning and I'll be back with you in just a second. All right, guys, I am back. So I've got it planned out, and what I'm going to need is five blocks of space. So one, two, three, four, five. So this will actually work out pretty much perfectly. Um, let's go ahead and make ourselves a crafting table real quick. And for the actual... The like wooden planks on the bridge. I think I want to use spruce. Um, and then I'm going to have basically fences that go along the side like ropes. And those will kind of um, act in that way. So what I'm going to have to do is get this shape going kind of like this and it should work the in, in theory at least this should work um so let's see we'll go one two one two i really just need I, you know what let me just pillar up there that'll be way easier so we'll just there we go much better okay so one two one two and then we'll go oh actually this is going to be a pain isn't it because here we need to go one, two, and one, two again. I'm going to have to build in the water. I absolutely detest building in the water. But we'll get something going like this. Now here, so it's one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And then right here, we're actually going to change it up to three, like that. And then down and over three again. And I'm not going to be able to reach those, am I? Nope, of course not. So we'll get something like this go. You can kind of see the shape starting to form. Okay. Then here, we're going to go one, two, three again. Break that up. Down. One, two, three again. And that should be good. And then basically the next one will be the lowest block. So now we basically just need to take this pattern and repeat it over on this side. So if we go one, two, three, four, five... That's our top right up here, Ooh, which I don't know if I can reach. One, two, three, four, five, right? Nope, that was one too high. There we go. Those should... I think that matches up. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, so... Oh, come on now. Work with me here. There we go. So one, two, one, two, and building in water is such a pain, by the way. I just, I dislike it. I think I've mentioned that. I'm mentioning it again. It's like one of my least favorite things. Okay, there we go. And then we're going one, two, and one, two again. There we go, like that. Then here is where we switch to threes, like so. And three again right there. Oh, come on. I believe in me. There we go. Three again. And then finally, three and three again. Beautiful. Okay. So we got, oh, did I lose a, did I lose one? I think I did. I see one over here. Are we good though? I think we're good. 
Right? Yes. Good. Okay. Now right here, we're going to just go ahead and bring that one all the, all the way across. So I think that's all good. Now, what we need to do is take our slabs and we're actually just going to go ahead and all along the bottom, we're just going to go ahead and tack one half slab onto the bottom like so. And I know you probably can't see. I can't really see either. I just know that the blocks are there. Uh, there we go. Okay. So that gives us kind of our basic bridge shape. And that looks pretty good, honestly. We've got the curve that we're going for. Just a slight dip. We don't want it to be, you know, super, super extravagant or anything like that. We want just a slight curve. Nothing too overpowering. Uh, so I think that'll work. Okay. Now, the next thing we need to do is I need to get up there again. There we go. And let's actually run over here and grab our slabs, any that we've dropped and all that kind of stuff. There we go. And now we need to add the bridge part. Uh, the part that you'll actually walk on, because this is part of the edge right here. So, let's just make ourselves like a little temporary staircase there. And let's make a whole bunch of... That's a creeper! Oh, no! Oh, man. Well... There goes a significant portion of my road. <sighs> Let me get that fixed up. Let me take a nap, guys, and I'll be back with you in just a minute. Well, that did not go as I had planned. These creepers have now ruined my island, my gatehouse, my pathway. <sighs> not a good day. All right, guys, I am back, and I think I'm finally patching up the last of the damage. There was another creeper that exploded in my warehouse as well. What is going on with creepers? Man, I have not had this many creeper issues for... Well, I don't know, but it's been a pretty long time. It's been a very long time since I've had this many problems with creepers. Holy cow. <sighs> oh, well. I think we got it all sorted out now. So, anyway. Um, oh, and then I left all of my oak slabs in the warehouse. Of course I did. So what I want to do is I want to get oak slabs in there, and then I want to get oak fences in there as well. And I think once that's done, we'll have to build up a little bit of a support structure. And then I think the bridge will look pretty good. So let me get some stuff together, and I'll come right back to you. All right, guys, I am back. So I've got my oak slabs this time around. I'm ready to actually get this done. So what we're going to do is we'll take our oak slabs and we'll come on up here. And then we're going to just basically put these on the bottom half of this block, just like so. And what that'll do is it's going to give us just a little bit of depth a little bit of shape as you're kind of running along this bridge here uh, and then it also gives us a guideline for where we need to put um our spruce lo our, our uh, spruce slabs right here like so see what i'm saying so real simple you know no need to overcomplicate things shall we say but it's going to give us the shape we want, and it's going to look pretty good, I think, once it's all done. So I'm going to get this all filled in and ready to go, and then I'll come right back to you. All right, guys, I am back. So we've got the bridge itself in place now, looking good. Um, let's go take a peek at it here. There we go. And I think it looks pretty good. I like the way it turned out. Um, 
What we need to- Ooh, hello skeleton, I see you. 1.9 skeletons. So much nastier. So much nastier. Anyway. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, anyway, so what we're doing is we've got this going. Now, I want to take oak fences like torch in the way like so and keep in mind I said these are basically going to be like ropes that kind of come across like this um, until they eventually get to the bottom over here and They'll go all the way along the bridge. Now, I'm going to need a lot, a lot more oak fences for this. So, let's make, let's do this. We'll make some sticks. We'll make some, nope, that's the gates. Just kidding. There we go. That's a bunch of fences. That should last us for at least a ways, I would think. And then I'll take a look and see what it looks like. So I'm going to get the fences in place, guys, and then I'll come right back to you. All right, guys, I am back. So there's our bridge. And that thing looks pretty good. I like it a lot, actually. I really like the way that it's turning out. Uh, there's still a couple things we need to do, though. We need to get kind of this staircase shape going up, like a support structure over here. Otherwise, it's going to look really weird. So... That's our next step, and pretty much our final step as well. So let's go ahead, and for now we'll just get rid of this acacia log support structure type thing. And then, uh, I'm just going to grab some cobblestone to use more as a guide than anything else. And we'll take some spruce logs, and I'm just going to put them down like this. And let's just see, how does that look? Okay, that's not terrible. We could do something like that. So to be like this, um, where's my guide blocks? There we go. Mm-hmm. Oh. And like so. Does that look pretty good? That looks about right. Uh, we'll ultimately terraform this a little bit so that it will match better. But I think that gives us the basic shape that we're looking for. And then we'll take our grass here. And make sure that that comes up all the way over here. Fill in a little bit of sand over in here, like a so. And that looks good. That looks really good to me. So now, we need... Really, we need stairs for this. We're going to need oak stairs for this part, uh, which is fine. That's perfectly fine. Let's go ahead and make some. Oh, I got things falling. There we go. And I think we'll want them like this. Maybe? No. No, we won't. We'll want them here? No. We'll want them here, I think. That's probably the level. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to want them at that level. Because then once you get up to the bridge, and we'll bring these slabs across one more. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Okay. So... Let's fix that up as well. Oh, wait. I don't need to put those away. Those are in the right spot already. Okay. That's fine. Here we go. Okay. So, we'll get our oak stairs in there. We'll put our pathway block here. And then down underneath here, I'm thinking I'll put in some oak stairs like that. How's that look? That looks good to me. And then the bridge. 
How's that look from over here? That looks good from over here as well. I think it'll do. So all I really need to do now is fix that up on the other side. So let me get that done, guys, and then I'll be right back. All right, guys, I am back, and I think the bridge is done. Look at that. We got ourselves a nice little rope bridge. It goes into the hill, keeping it real simple, but real effective. I like it. I think it's good. I think it gets the job done, and I also think that I am very much out of time for this episode, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.